Alfred Bernhard Nobel Alfred Bernhard Nobel is known as a chemical scientist, inventor, and entrepreneur from Sweden. He found dynamite and other explosives. However, his name became better known after holding the Nobel Prize. He holds approximately 355 different patents. Apart from dynamite, Nobel also holds patents for weapons such as cannons. Quoted from various sources, the following is a biography of Nobel. 1. Childhood Nobel was born on October 21, 1833 in Stockholm, and was the fourth of eight children of Emmanuel and Carolina Nobel. His father was an engineer and inventor. Even so, his family was relatively poor. Therefore, Emmanuel tried his luck. When Nobel was four years old, his father moved to St. Petersburg, Russia, to take a job in explosives production. His business began to reap success after Emmanuel invented the veneer lathe and torpedo. In 1842, his family followed to Russia. His parents brought a private teacher to the house. Apart from school lessons, Nobel also gained an understanding of English, French, German and Russian. To go traveling and become a discoverer. Because he had good grades in chemistry, Nobel studied with the Russian chemist Nikolai Zinin. In 1850, he went to Paris, France. He met Italian scientist Ascanio Sobrero who discovered liquid nitroglycerin. Nobel was interested in developing it as a multipurpose explosive. However, Sobrero opposed his wishes, who explained that the compound was unpredictable and could explode if exposed to heat or pressure. At the age of 18, he went to the United States U.S. and lived there for a year to study. He studied with John Erickson. Erickson is a Swedish US scientist known for developing the USS Monitor warship during the Civil War era. After five years, he returned to Russia and helped his father develop factories after Russia was plunged into the Crimean War. The war, which lasted from October 16, 1853 to March 30, 1856, ended with the defeat of the Russian Empire by the combination of the Ottoman Empire, France, and England. Because of this defeat, the Nobel family factory went bankrupt. 1859, Emmanuel entrusted control of the factory to his second son, Ludwig. He and the rest of the family returned to Sweden. Nobel decided to study explosives, especially the efficient and safe use of nitroglycerin. In 1863, he invented the detonator and developed it two years later. Disaster struck Nobel on September 3, 1864. At that time, a warehouse for preparing nitroglycerin exploded in Helenborg, killing five people, including his younger brother, Emil. The incident was accompanied by other minor incidents. Nobel decided to establish another factory with a focus on improving and stabilizing the explosives he had developed. In 1867, he discovered dynamite after mixing nitroglycerin with Kieselguer soil. The explosive was easier to handle than nitroglycerin. Dynamite was immediately patented in the US and England, and was used in businesses such as opening mines, railroads, and weapons. 1875, he discovered gelignite or exploding gelatin, a substance much more stable and strong than dynamite. Ten years later, he registered a patent for ballastite, an explosive material known to be a precursor to cordite. His various discoveries resulted in Nobel being appointed a member of the Royal Swedish Academy of Scientists in 1884, and receiving the title of Honorary Doctor at Uppsala University in 1893. Three issuance of the Nobel Prize Two Nobel brothers, Ludwig and Robert, developed oil fields in the Caspian Sea and became rich. Unfortunately, Ludwig died while visiting Kahn in 1888. 
a French daily published Nobel's obituary criticizing him for inventing dynamite. L.E. Marchand de la Mort est Mort the Merchant of Death is Dead, read the obituary. Provoked and worried about how he would be remembered after he was gone, Nobel decided to donate some of his wealth to establish the Nobel Prize. Taking place at the Swedish-Norwegian Club of Paris on November 27, 1895, Nobel signed a final will to award an annual prize without regard to the winner's nationality. Nobel donated 94% of its total assets, which after taxes amounted to 31,225 krona in 2012 the equivalent of 472 million US dollars. There are five categories in the initial awards. Namely the Nobel Prize in Physics, Nobel Chemistry, Nobel Literature, Nobel Medicine, and Nobel Peace Prize. In 1969, Sweden's Central Bank, Sveriges Riksbank, established the Nobel Prize in Economics in honor of Alfred Nobel. For death. Because he was considered to have committed treason against France by selling ballastite to Italy, in 1891 Nobel moved to San Remo. On December 10, 1896, Alfred Nobel died from a stroke at the age of 63. He was buried in Stockholm's Norabegravningsplatsen Northern Cemetery.